Oh, you're just like Akira. <laughs> you made it just in time. Are you here for the festival? Or would you like to see the show? Come here. Stand right over here with me. Watch as we see the humans destroy themselves. Isn't it exciting? Hmm? What are you talking about? I didn't cause anything. I simply went on TV and told everyone the truth. That demons exist. Now humans are going against each other. The final act has started. The act of... What's the word? Salvation. Yes, salvation. For as you see, these humans don't deserve such. Now they're starting to behave as they should. As humans. You see, I have pushed their back against the wall, revealing what a human truly is. Evil. No, it isn't because of the demons that humans are acting this way. It's because humans can't control their desires. And what does a human desire most of all? Power. Control. And when they feel like they're not in control anymore, everything is over. All bets are off the table. It suddenly becomes the second coming of Armageddon. And no one is going to escape it. Not even you. What could you do with the power that you have? Absolutely nothing. You might as well just stay quiet. In your agony. In your grief. Oh, I know how it hurts. It doesn't feel good to have so many people turn their back on you, huh? You never would have thought. So-called friends. So-called family. And they only come to you when they need something. Isn't that ironic? <laughs> you... You poor, innocent thing. <laughs> You're too nice for this world. And that's why you'll die. Unless you join me. Because I can keep you safe. After all, I know how this story ends. I mean, clearly, you don't want to die now, do you? Oh. <laughs> Come here. Take my hand. Don't be afraid. <laughs> Isn't it obvious by now? Oh, do I have to say it? Well, my poor fallen angel. I'm Satan. That's why. Oh, this is funny. You're looking at me like I'm some monster. I'm the same guy. I mean, not guy. Technically, I'm not a guy. I'm a spirit. A spirit. And I've been here since the beginning of time. Changing and manipulating laws. Creating a way that humans can't remember. Who they really are. And now it's too late. They spent too much time playing video games and watching TV. <laughs> and I haven't even dropped the big ball yet. Oh, just you wait until humans realize that everything that they feared, their greatest fears, are actually a reality. Oh, the perfect horror show. The time of horror has begun. And nothing is going to stop what is coming. Nothing. Nothing. No prayer you pray now is going to save you. But I can. You don't have to go through what they do. Because you're different. I actually like you. I can't say I love you because I don't believe in love being real, but... <gasps> you remind me. You remind me of... Never mind. 
You must be what he meant. Why, there's still hope for humanity. It's too bad that you're a devil now. So you're not even human. So why even care? These people betrayed you over and over again. They took your trust and they stomped all over it. They said, we'll help you. We love you. We'll give you everything. You mean so much to me. And oh, those seem to be nothing but mere words. Because when you need it the most, they disappeared. You were alone, trapped in your own darkness. You couldn't face the reality of what you knew, of what you found out. And now, now at a crucial time in history, I can give you everything you want. Because I want you. When the humans are gone, only demons will be on the planet until the Righteous One comes back. <sighs> and I will rage war in the heavens, and you will join me. You will join me. <laughs> I know it's hard to choose. You feel like you'll be damned. Well, what if I told you? You already are. You're my child. And I have been watching over you since the beginning. I knew one day you'd realize the truth. I am the one who's going to set you free from the bondage of human beings. Come to me. Don't let my arms go to waste. Run into them. Find shelter. Find safety. Find a new world. A world that's not plagued by pain or hate. A world that's governed by me. That's governed by enlightenment. Do you understand? They can't make it to the next dimension. They're too fragile, too weak. And because of this, it's only going to be easier to destroy them. Oh, oh. Do you know how it feels to watch your plan, the plan you've set out on since the beginning of time? be executed so perfectly. I guess that is true. Everything is divine. Even mine. Mm. My dear, the people who talk to you, they don't have your best interest. No. You see, what they want is your money, is your power, is your energy. <laughs> Trust me, I know a Jezebel any time I see one. You're not going to give in, are you? <laughs> you might as well give in to me if that's the case. Because they want what I want. But at least I'm more transparent. You see, I'll be honest with you. I'll tell you the truth. You don't know that you're talking to the devil in disguise. And they're masquerading as an angel. Oh. <laughs> oh. The Yoda's trick in the book. <laughs> oh, humans, so, so ignorant. But it makes it even more fun for me. For you. And me. I'm only going to ask you one more time. And then the choice will be up to you. Come now, my child, back into your mother's arms. For in me, you'll have rest. For God created the world. 
in six days. And on the seventh day, he rested. I am here to tell you that the time is nigh that you will have to choose a side. Whether you will join forces with me or you will meet your end with your puny little human friends. I believe I've shown you enough to prove that they don't care about you. Now, please don't make this complicated. You know as much as I do where you belong. And where you belong is here. Jeremiah 1111. Therefore thus saith the Lord, Behold, I will bring evil upon them, which they shall not be able to escape. And though they shall cry unto me, I will hearken unto them not. 